Alberto team coverage continues. A water rescue in Dolphin Island sent the Coast Guard scrambling. Riptides and strong currents pulled a man hundreds of yards from shore. News 5's Nicolette Schleisman has more from Dolphin Island. It's your lifeline. It's up to your leg. Your surfboard's not going to go anywhere. Randy Loftus knows he has to be careful when he's out on the rough surf. I've been doing it all my life. They're really used to the to the rip currents. Um, I know it's bad, and so we don't want to tell people to do that. With conditions the way they are, the Coast Guard warns people against getting in the water. And when you have big storms like that brewing offshore, even if they're still a long ways from us, they're pulling so much water, it's a big deal with rip currents. But that didn't stop one man from getting on his float and being pulled hundreds of yards from shore. It was a successful rescue, but a reminder of how dangerous the water can be. They really are the silent killer because they're just sucking that water back from offshore. As the waves are crashing on the shore, rip currents running hard underwater, and um, you can be caught in it before you know it and be pulled a good ways offshore. But that doesn't stop Loftus and others from coming out enjoying the surf, but being careful. As long as you've got this, you're safe. If you don't have this, and you're on your own. Now. That was Nicolette Schleisman reporting from Dolphin Island.